туда, по дном залазьте, вытягивайте жмурек. So these are the old Ukrainian front lines and we're going to move from here to the old Russian positions, the new Ukrainian positions that they've now taken. Uh, uh, where you see a little greenery in front of you, there was Russians before. So it was our positions and there was Russians. How many meters? Really? About 50 meters from here. So this is a firing position from the old Ukrainian front line. And there's a stench. It's pretty unpleasant. And that's because if I look out here from where this, where this position would have looked onto no man's land and barbed wire, there is in front of me the rotting remains of a dead Russian soldier. So all along this, trend, this tree line behind me, the old Russian position and down here, evidence of what the soldiers left behind. These are the remains of the old Russian positions that at their closest were just 40 meters away from the Ukrainian front line and walking through this devastation. It's really easy to see that comparisons with World War One sort of trench warfare really were no exaggeration. And in this position, they've told us that we can poke our head above the parapets to try and see what's out there. But if we want to, it's for 20 seconds at a time maximum because of the risk of snipers and return fire. The 150 meters there. And what's that? What are the explosions? What? The explosions? This is Russian position. So while we've been here, there's been a fairly constant thunder of uh, artillery. And uh, we understand there's a Russian gun about 200 meters away that's shooting over our heads. So it's incoming artillery, but it's going over our position. They uh, can uh, use uh, artillery here and grad artillery they are, they are set because we are, took back our place and uh, they shelling every every day and many times per day and before i remember you said it was like world war one in trenches and now does it still feel like world war one yeah, more than uh, before so this is the position as close as we can get to the Russian lines. This is the last, this is the front line for Ukrainian troops. It was dug three days ago, these trenches. They took over what were just a couple of foxholes that the Russians had abandoned. And now they're facing off against the Russian soldiers from about 150 to 200 meters away.